Today I thought we could um, continue with Maureen reading some magic information. Um, so that's what we are about to do here. I did get her in a little bit better mood. So we'll um, start with uh, what we ended with before. So we can um, start by looking up some magic duels here. Looking up some information on that. Um, excuse Hunter and Bullet, they are barking at something. So it says, the dueling arena provides the forum for all magic duels in Magic Town, mainly because the five dueling spells are built into the arena. Each spell is more powerful than two of the other spells, and the colored orbs correspond to each spell name. Once you've used a spell during a duel, its color will disappear, and the orb will then display whether you won or lost the round. Feel free to challenge anyone to a duel, but remember mastering the arena takes brains, not brawn. Now ask about magic coins. The commerce in Magic Town reaches far beyond the borders of Sim City. So many Magic Town inhabitants have adopted the use of magic coins for their day-to-day -day transactions. You can acquire magic coins by performing for the crowds or selling your own wares. Okay, so we did um, acquire some magic coins last time, um, last episode. We can now, let's ask about magic vendors, see what we can get from them. There are three magical vendors who show up around Magic Town. They're the purveyors of fine and rare ingredients, as well as the keepers of their respective shops. Try talking to them. They're very busy and are always asking people to help them out in exchange for rare ingredients. Okay, so like we help the, um... The snake dude we can see what other sorts of people are around town that we might be able to help out okay so then we also have secret ingredients let's figure out what that's about here spell books and cookbooks are great places to find recipes and lists of ingredients but that doesn't mean they all contain they can that but that doesn't mean they contain all the ingredients it has been rumored that some magical devices can also make use of certain secret ingredients. Okay. Oh, so that's everything for that book. Okay, so, oh wow, six pages? Oh my god. Wow. So, okay, so mix these three ingredients to discover the hidden nature of the spell. So you don't know what these spells do until you mix them. Or you get the ingredients and try them. That's pretty cool. Actually. That's really neat. They have to wait. So uh, it looks like the first. They, they probably gave us the ingredients. Yeah for the first um, spell here. So maybe we can try out a spell. How do we go about. Um, it says that you need to use that machine there. Which is right here. Okay, let's add everything to this, um, machine. Oh, what's going on there? She can't get to it. Okay. Okay, she just added some toad sweat. We're gonna add some toad stools and some butter. And we're gonna see what happens here. Uh, spells are brewed from three parts. Make sure you've added three ingredients before trying to charge your wand. We can charge our wand then, right? Hmm, what's going on? You've discovered a new spell. Check your family spell book for details. Okay. Ooh. Okay, so toadification. Sometimes you just need a toad. Have you tried getting a toad from the ships in Old Town? Of course you have. Did you find one? Of course you didn't. That's because toads were run out of SimCity after the mayor's wife was caught kissing an especially slimy toad. But now you can get your own toad. Just tempor temporarily toadify whomever you want. Friends, family, enemies, neighbors. All of them are just begging for toadification. Just be careful that people don't catch you casting it. As toads are still illegal in many areas of SimCity. Okay. What is this? Three butters? Beeswax. What's this? Honey? Pixie dust? Maybe we get that from a fairy or something? Golden thread, magic beans. Okay. Okay. Very interesting. Oh, so she has two totifications. 
So she would have to do that to somebody. Sir, Joshua. Oh, Joshua. Can we toadify you? Can we turn you into a toad? Poor Joshua. Um, cast, totification, no oh boy. Damn. Oh, there's a freaking. Oh, we can kiss the toad. Hold on a second here. Joshua. Go kiss the toad. What does this do to you? Does it turn you into a freaking toad? No, there's no way. Oh, Lord. She looks around. <laughs> nope. <laughs> she did not enjoy that kiss. What happens if you do it twice? Does I mean, what's the point? Is it just for the animation? Okay, well, I guess we'll just let Joshua, uh... Um, whoa, what's this? What is this animation? His little thought bubble. Is he in love with her? Is he gonna turn... Is he gonna be in love with her when he comes back? Now he's just riveting. Oh. Well, what just happened? Did he kiss her for real? If we try to, like... We just chat with you, dude? I mean... So I don't think it really, um, has anything to, it, I don't think it really does anything else besides that. Yeah, let's, just goodbye. You were just our guinea pig. And now we, now he doesn't like us. Oh well. Too bad. Bye, Joshua. She still needs a friend for her job. Um, it's 11, 11 at night. I don't know if that is too late to call someone. I would think maybe midnight would be too late, but we'll find out. Oh, uh, we need to call what's his face? Drog here. It might be too late. I hope not. Okay, nope. They get along. They're, they get along pretty good so far. Um, she has a long way to go to be his friend. That went. Their relationship went down quite a bit. But um, <clears throat> uh, we, uh, we obviously we can't invite him over. I don't think he would come over this late at night. Can he get it before twelve? Oh, it's eleven fifty-nine. Do you think he's going to say yes? Probably not. It's, it's 12 o'clock now, so... Oh, okay. He's coming on over. Sweet. Sweet. We need a friend. Maybe we could get Drog here. See how the relationship goes. Maybe we could get him to, um... Become our roommate. He can be Maureen's lover. There he is. Oh uh, yeah, I just want to look real quick at a job just to see what, what else is, if we can find something that pays more. Although I do like the idea of this animal job. See, no. Got the military again. That's not what we want. Let's go, um, let's go talk to Drog here. What a name. Oh, he's going to leave because it's late. God damn it. Well, we got one point in friendship. So let's do like... Uh, let's do seven. A lucky number. Do one more. And, uh, maybe we can just get to know some more folk. Okay, so she's actually in a really good mood. I wonder how much, I mean, these must be working. Walk? What does that mean? Does that make it work or something? Run? Oh, um, it must make things go up here. We can do a power nap or enable free will nap. Uh, we'll keep the enable free will nap off for now. I'd like to actually get some of her uh, mechanical up and maybe some other skills up before we head back. Um, I think maybe this episode we'll do we'll stay at home a little bit. We might uh, go out to Magic Town maybe towards the end or something. But uh, we want to try to be, become friends with um, Drog here at least. Get, maybe get her promotion. Uh, and of course keep an eye on the paper to see if we can get anything else that we find suitable. We're starting to get our visitors here. I think we know this guy already though. So maybe we'll just do a few um, friendly interactions here with, 
with him. Let's see how we get along. Okay, so she's gonna go to work in an hour, but she's in a really good mood. Look at this, her um her wants are not changing while she's at work. That's really cool. Okay, we're gonna uh get her some mechanical here. You sold your patent for a left handed monkey wrench. Collect three hundred dollars. Cool. Why well, thank you, sir. Oh, here's Nut. Can Canute Nut. Let's let's greet this fella here. So we are this is really cool, we're getting a lot of visitors. Um, I'm thinking eventually like she'll meet everyone, so but then again it, it also said that it's gonna have her um people that she already knows will show up, which is nice. That might help with relationships. Nut Davidson. Okay, Nut, why don't you head out? I should probably call a dog here and invite him over. He should be home. Yes, okay. He's, he's headed over. Let's make some, some food real quick. Oh, there's Luther. Luther is not who we're looking for. Hold on, Luther. Oh, no. Okay, don't eat. I don't really want to invite this guy in because then, uh... I mean, I guess we can, but I really just wanted to kind of work on a relationship with him. So we're kind of... We're going to kind of ignore, uh, Luther here. Hopefully it doesn't become, um, distracting. And now that I'm thinking about it, um, that table that we looked at could actually probably be helpful you know, when she has people over. They're actually getting along really well. Can we? I don't really want to like try to kiss him or anything. Can we tickle him? Ah, uh, fuck it. Let's try to kiss him. We're at 45 over 8. This is probably not going to go well. Oh no. It was just a kiss on the cheek. He enjoyed that, okay. We do a suave kiss. Nope. No, he's not interested. Okay, we made a friend here. Okay, we're 70 over 14, so that seems fine with me. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna say goodbye to everyone. Um. Oh, you know what I need to do? You know what my problem is? Why my knees aren't aren't changing? It's this party plant. Let's think about that last time. I'm only gonna use that for parties. Work on your mechanical. I want to try to get her mechanical up. Because it seemed that uh, two skill points didn't really help a whole lot for Marine. We have another visitor here. Uh, Tim. But she has to go to work. Let's try drawing again. We should... I'd like to tr figure out the exact time so we know. Oh, he, he doesn't want to talk to us apparently. Loomer. Okay, you have a, a funky name, Loomer. Can we just chat with this fellow here? Try to make some friends. He looks like uh, he belongs with you. Look at his outfit. He really does. Holy shit. You guys have like the same color. Color outfit. Oh, we made a new friend. Holy shit. Uh, what's going on with my mouse? Good right now. Let's just serve some dinner. Keep this guy around a little bit. Maybe we can become better friends with him. I think he just left. Damn it. Well, whatever. She needs to eat. No, he's right there. Okay. We, maybe we could try to kiss this dude. Just for the fuck of it and see how this goes here. No, he's not, he doesn't like that. I think, uh, maybe taking a little too fast. Maybe we should just try to, like, talk to him. Oh, Jesus, we got a better relationship with this guy than him. Maybe Bloom, or Loomer Strange is the one to go for. I don't know, but he's not having a good time. He's, yeah, he's gonna leave. That's fine. It's getting late. Anyway, we need to, we can test out this, uh, chair over here that we just got. Let's, uh, power nap and see what happens. I think I'm gonna have to pull this away from the... No? Oh, wow. Wow, did you see that? Holy hell. That is gonna be a... An asset, I tell you. That is, a, that is an asset right there. Let's take a shower. And, um, so this is really allowing... Uh, these couple of things are really allowing me to, um... Work on her skills a lot more. Which is nice. Okay, Marina has been promoted to a sheep custodian. Ah, now that now this is the good life. One of your rich clients hired you to groom and tend their prize-winning herd of sheep. Learn how to fix things around the ranch as you daydream about life as a medieval peasant. It's a lonely existence, but you can always socialize with the sheep. Uh, she now works 9 to 3. 
and she brought home 185 with a bonus of 370 um which is nice but oh, look at her outfit oh my goodness that's cool it's a cute outfit um but again we're gonna keep searching for maybe a, a little bit more high paying job musician 90 a day um that's even cheaper than what you had I don't think I want to. I don't think I want to do that. A nut is here again. See, uh, that means we. This is nice. This is really good because we have people coming over that we already know that we can kind of chat with. Um, I think it's going to help us make friends a lot more. Even though you know we don't get along uh, wonderful with this guy, we at least he keeps coming over so that we can work on our relationship. And then, oh, here's Sharma. That's the girl I made. Could definitely greet her. We haven't met her yet. But, uh, what's our relationship with, uh, Nut here? Canute. Canute or Nut. Um, 21. Hey, oh, here's... Oh, here's, uh, Crater Rack, or whatever his name is, from, uh, Magic Town. Alright, we have quite a few people here. We could actually, you know, maybe she should, should make some food. We don't have a radio, that's one thing that we don't have, we should probably get. Um, this is a really nice radio. But, thus, we don't have very much money, so we're going to have to get just a regular old... Oh, I have a couple of free stands here, if I probably put it on there, I assume. We'll see. Um... Okay, there's our radio. Is that even facing the right way? I think so. Alright. Turn let's make some food, turn the radio on, kinda of like a little uh get together. I hope these people will come in once there's once the food is cooked. Um and we could uh we could greet Oh wow, we're getting all kinds of cu uh customers. People coming to the house, I don't know why I said customers. Right. This food's gonna be gone. Yep in no time let's clean that up real quick so everyone is chatting with everyone so this would be cool if you had I wonder if you had like a different sim from around the, the neighborhood um if that their relationships would reflect when you went back into their household look at her little hat that's so funny all right do, do we want to um join in some dancing there we go I think I have the music turned way down so you won't be able to hear it well but Okay, oh, you know what would be a good um, thing to throw in here now? The party thingy. I, think, I mean, we're not act technically having a party, so I don't know if that's actually going to work. But it seems to um, not be working, actually. <laughs> oh, well. We probably just wasted that money. But uh, we can uh, kind of chat with this Sydney girl over here. See if we can make some friends. Uh, what? Oh, what's going cool? Whoa! What is going down here? Who's here? <laughs> Drew Carey! Hey, my agent said I just had to come over. Let's crank this party up. What? Bro, what? Oh, my mouse. What am I doing with this mouse? No shit. Drew, the celebrity. Look at his red shoes. I've, this has never occurred to me. I've seen this. Um, on other people's videos, but I must be having a pretty... I wasn't even actually technically having a party, so that's that's cool. Maybe the party plant, like, started a party? I don't know. Oh, you can't talk to Drew here, but he is thus here. Um, okay. Uh, hello, yeah, I'm at the party now. Yeah, baby, hit me on my cell in a few hours. Yeah, tell them 10% of the gross. Ciao, baby, you gotta make this scene. Okay. So we can just basically come here and like listen to him. I don't know what he's doing, but okay, he's 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 coming into the party. We can't interact with him, but maybe he'll talk to us. I don't know. And also, I think maybe the party plant um started working because every all the needs have uh, gone up. Let's clean this up, though, Marine. Uh, let's take care of that a little bit while we can. Okay, we can come out here and maybe kind of talk to this dude a little bit. Oh, oh! He's greeting her! There's no way that she'll know him, though. Oh, everyone's le everyone's gonna be leaving. That must- does that happen when he leaves? He must greet you and then leave, maybe. 
Okay, so everyone's leaving. They're chatting. They're talking about vehicles. I, sh I really don't. Yeah, she's not going to know him in here, but. Wow. So you can't um, do anything yourself, but she can. Or it can autonomously happen, apparently. Okay, so we can we just. He says, awesome party. Let's keep in touch later, later, baby. Okay. Bye, Drew. Well, that was um, interesting. Okay. Alright, let's shut this off. Let's pay her bills. Let's get back to reality here. Um, oh, she checked. What? She just checked that herself? Okay. Uh, it says, today is day 26. So, it is not a weekend. Yeah, she's like, eh, I don't want to go to work. Yuck. Well, she does need some new skills for work. Um, so I guess we can work on that. Even though, um, we're probably going to be getting her a different job. She has 777 simoleons. She doesn't need this bed anymore, um, because she has that recliner. So we're, we're going to use it. At this point, I'm just going to say, fuck it, we're going to use it. I guess we can get her one of these for now. We'll probably end up deleting that. We'll probably end up deleting this later on if she doesn't need it for work, because, um, that was really expensive. Okay, she got her one body. Let's go. We're just going to try to crank this out. And I don't know if she's going to be in a good enough mood for work. But she might be. Okay, she's been promoted again. Now she's an Aquarian technician. Um, you decided to dive right into a new job. But it's not all scrubbing and rearranging the clams. You need to feed a variety of weird foreign fish. their special foods and even put a little show... Put on little shows for the public. Just remember not to put the octopus, oct octopus in with the lobsters. She now works from 12 to 5. Uh, she brought home 250 with a bonus of 500. Wow. She's actually doing really good in this uh, career. <laughs> She'll probably get another uh, promotion actually tomorrow. Let's see if we can get her one more promotion and then we'll end this video. Um, she has two friends. I don't think she needs any so... That's good. Uh, we could just have her come greet this guy and maybe chat with him. Her outfit has changed again. Now she's wearing like a, um, a skiba suit. He's probably looking for food. Let's make, oops, let's make some, some dinner here. Let's use our little cheat here. Yeah, man, look at that. Okay. Apparently she's gonna hog down another plate of food. Oops. Okay. Might as well clean that up. You're not going to need that. She doesn't work until noon, so we could just, um... Really, she's in a, a really good mood right now, so... We could just have her study some more mechanical for her... I I, I think it was logic, too. We should really get her, like, a, a checkers table or a chess table to work on her logic um, for her magic. Alright, that's good there. Uh, Carolina, I don't think we've met her yet. Get her something to eat. She goes to work fairly soon here. Uh, have her take a little power nap. Go to the bathroom. Uh, yeah, okay, she's gonna read. Cool. Another promotion to zookeeper. Lucky for you, aquarium and zoo employees are part of the same union, so you can transfer without anyone nagging you about qualifications. But tending land animals is a big is a bit tougher than aquatic critters. You need to be stronger for this one, and you have to perform more pseudo scientific in edutain edutainment for the tourists. You will work. Uh, okay, so she works from 6 a.m. to 12 p.m. She brought home 3:45 and a bonus of 6:90. Wow, she's she's killing it. She is killing that career, man. It's probably because she's in such a good mood too. Let's just look. I'm just curious what other type of job there is. Uh, no, okay, we'll stick with the one we have. Let's take care of this stuff so that it's all cleaned up for her. And then I guess we're going to end this episode here. She's in a really fantastic mood. Um, these are working really well. I don't um, feel too cheaty, like I said, about them because... Um, oh, this, oh, we have a uh, celebrity here. Okay. But anyway, um, yeah, we're going to be done with this uh, episode for now. And I will bring you another one shortly. Um, and we'll get more back into Magic Town. Um, she has gained, um, she actually has five mechanical skill points now. So I think that's really going to help her, um, in Magic Town. 
and we'll also learn, work on our logic and kind of trying to learn how um, the dueling works um, would be helpful because it still confuses me a little bit. So, yeah. Um, see you in the next episode. Bye.